Yeah, okay, fuckers and fuckettes. What we got right now is I've just torqued down my head bolts, and if you don't own a torque wrench, please, God, don't do this. If you don't know how to use a torque wrench, read your book. And if you can't do that, don't put a wrench to the heads on your fucking bike. Um, these triumphs, well, hell, pretty much everything has an initial torque, but when you're doing this and you don't know how to do it, I'm going to try and make this as simple as possible. There's an order that you do on the bolts. Now you need to look in your shop manual for your particular bike, but generally like on these Triumph Triples, it's one, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, and eight. Now you torque them to your initial torque, your first torque, which on this one is like fucking, yeah, I don't know, it's like, uh, what? The hell, I got it wrote down somewhere here. Let's see, it's uh, 27 nm the first time, which is what maybe 20 20 foot pounds you can go on the web and do the conversion um, and then you go around again in the same order and you torque them that second time to 35 newton meters which is in um, and I think I just went on ahead and did them at 28 foot pounds um, that second time I like it a little bit heavy, and that really translates to like 25 or 26. I'm just doing the math in my fucking head. You need to do, uh, go on the internet and do a uh, search if you want to be exact about it. But um, Now, after you're done, you go around them again, and you turn them 90 degrees. Now, if you don't know what 90 degrees is, that is a quarter of a turn. Don't guess. Get them all the same. 90 degrees after you finish your second pass on the torquing. And in a minute I'm going to put these cams in and I've kept track of which cap goes on which one so everything's going to be all hunky-dory there. But before I do that, I'm going to get everything in here with some engine loop. And this is uh, CRC slash, it used to be Stay Lube. CRC owns them now. Uh, maybe they owned them all along, but I've always called it Stay Lube Engine Assembly Lube. Um, make sure you grease every goddamn thing and grease them good. God damn, that shit's bringing up metal filings. There we go, that's better. Get that shit in there. Take your finger. Rub that shit in there. Make sure everything gets coated with it. Don't do like you do when you're tapping your old lady up the rear end and you just put a little bit of grease on your willy. Uh-uh, this is a motorcycle. It's a lot more important than your old lady. Use the shit out of this grease. Let it slop in there. Make sure you got plenty in there. More than you need is not enough. I mean, you're going to be changing your oil in another 50 miles to get all this out of there anyway. Get everything coated good before you go to put those cams in there. And I should mention, too, you need to, uh, before you set your cams back in, um, you need to uh, go on ahead. I'll get that other side in a second here. You need to go on ahead and um, grease your cams, too, as you're putting them in. But clean them first. Put them in your damn parts washer. If you don't have a parts washer, hey, use some diesel fuel or something. And make sure they come straight out of the cleaner, straight into the motor, so that there ain't no shit on them. There ain't no shit in all them little, see these little passages and stuff. You want that shit clean. And don't fuck around. Like I say, this is a motorcycle you're talking about. It ain't some woman or something that you don't give a shit about or, you know, 
you might not never see her again this is your motorcycle this is what you got to depend on um, grease everything don't be afraid to be sloppy with the grease fuck it motor oil is going to rinse that shit out of there and then you're going to be changing it ain't really break in oil because obviously an engine this old is already broke in but uh, you're going to be changing your oil in 50 miles anyway so you might as well slop it in there and make sure you got plenty on that shit um, okay so that covered torquing your heads down give me just a minute I'm going to shut this shit off upload this one I'm going to get my cams set up um, I don't know if I'm using these cams or another set these are pretty rough um, I'm going to clean them up and see if they don't pretty up but uh, fuck I hate using these goddamn things I, I hate it when they're ugly and like I say when you uh, clean these in the parts washer blow out all them little passages squirt everything with this assembly loop be liberal with the shit don't be cheap with the shit and this ain't this is your this is your ride. This is what keeps you going. Treat her right. You know, don't treat her don't, don't treat her like some little crack whore you picked up on the corner. Treat her like your baby because that's what she is. Anyway, holler at y'all fuckers and fuckettes later. And remember, bikes before bitches, y'all.